Florida's newest law signed by the governor today goes into effect immediately. It helps shield businesses and health care providers from lawsuits related to the coronavirus. ABC Action News reporter Ryan Smith digging into the impact right here in Tampa Bay. One year after the state shut down. Early on when we were fighting this, there was so much unknown. We were just pivoting as quickly as possible. Jeff Giganti is thankful for Beachy's doors remain open. He calls Florida's COVID-19 lawsuit protection bill critical in helping business owners survive the pandemic. So it's the burden of defending yourself, which costs thousands of dollars. And small businesses, a lot of them are struggling at this time coming out of this pandemic. They don't have the extra resources to defend these frivolous lawsuits. Signed into law on Monday, businesses, governments, and healthcare providers will be widely protected from COVID-19 lawsuits. The worker or plaintiff would have to show that the defendant deliberately ignored guidelines preventing the spread of the coronavirus. The plaintiff would also need a signed note from a doctor stating with reasonable certainty that injury or death caused by COVID-19 was a result of the defendant's actions. I believe there could be very prolonged court battles and interpretation of some of these phrases will find their way all the way to the Florida Supreme Court. Those in opposition argue it protects big business not workers. What the governor signed today is a is a is a blank check. Uh, no matter no matter what businesses did, uh, no matter what they didn't do, uh, everybody's got this blanket immunity. And no matter who was was harmed or how they were damaged. In Tampa, Ryan Smith, ABC Action News.